monitor used to track heartbeat and oxygen levels has been pulled off the shelves. Yeah, the FDA is cracking down on the Utah-based company Owlet, saying that they cannot sell their showcase item. Debbie Worthen joined us live tonight. And Debbie, what's this whole thing about? Well, uh, Outlet became a target of the FDA last month when the when it said the company was marketing their smart sock as a medical device without proper proper approval. Well, now Outlet pulled that that uh, product from the shelves, and parents that love it are not happy about it. He wants the camera. <laughs> Three busy kids. The amount of security that that can add is it's priceless. At the main household. Mm. Claire just turned one last week. You get one, you know, early like she was. She was five weeks early. And uh, she only weighed about five pounds. And especially when they're premature, they have some breathing problems still. Their lungs aren't quite all the way developed. Katie made sure when they brought her home, they had the Owlet Smart Sock. This part just wraps underneath the foot. Easy to use, but more importantly, Having some kind of peace of mind for us, um, just to make sure that in addition to the precautions we were already taking, that we could just make sure and catch anything that might be going on. Parents will no longer be able to purchase the Outlet Smart Sock. The company releasing this statement to KSL 5 TV tonight, reading in part, Outlet received a warning letter from the FDA regarding the Smart Sock's regulatory status in the United States. As a result of the letter, and in light of our plans to submit a device application to the FDA, we will no longer be selling the Smart Sock. That news comes as a disappointment to Katie. As far as taking it entirely off the market, like they're doing, that is a little bit scary because it still is, it's another tool that you can use. On the company's website this week, Outlet says the app for the Outlet Smart Sock will not be impacted for those who have already downloaded it. For new customers, a new app, along with a new product, will be coming soon. Katie says parents she knows never look to the Smart Sock as something to cure or prevent any type of medical condition or disease. I know it's not intended to be diagnosing anything, and I don't think anyone's really expecting it to be that way. It's more just... Uh, having a way to make sure that everything is okay. And FDA approved or not, Katie would buy it again. I mean, it's just like having a baby monitor. I mean, the FDA didn't really have to approve having a camera on your child to make sure they're not getting caught in things. Well, Outlet released that letter on their website yesterday, and it also says that they consider customers their family, and they believe that customers deserve transparency, and they will definitely keep their customers posted on what happens next. Back to you. Yeah, right now it seems like there's going to be quite a few disappointed customers out there. Debbie, thank you.